Oh, hi. Yesterday, I popped open this bad boy, numero seven, and this thing is stacked. This is a uh, triple decker bus from that was. Um, whoops, I know it. I'm just recovering the name from my memory banks. Prisoner of Azkaban was where this one was featured when Harry ran away and then they picked them up. And it's funny, if this bus hadn't shown up when it did, that wolf probably would have gotten Harry and been like, Hey, it's me. Everything's cool. I didn't kill anybody. Stay away from Voldemort. But no. Instead, they, we assumed that the wolf was a bad guy, and, you know, it's all good. But anyway, I like this build. It's clever. Enough. Simple enough while still being clever, I guess. Actually, it's not really clever at all. I don't know why I said that. It's simple. And it looks good. Looks like a triple-decker bus. I thought maybe there'd be a light up here. But, yeah, I guess it works. I like the lamppost, and like it's stopping next to the sidewalk where Harry was. So it's cool, I can dig it. More pieces than you might expect, but I'll take more bank for my buck. So let's put this being the first of these orange deals over here. Ooh, with the time turner. <gasps> with the time turner. Wait, does, are these? Hold on. I think I just realized something that in retrospect seems obvious and should have been obvious before but wasn't. I just realized that these little picture symbols represent a movie which means we're getting three builds from each movie okay that's cool that's awesome actually okay yeah Deathly Hollows 2 Deathly Hollows 1 Half-Blood Prince, Order of the Phoenix, Goblet of Fire, Prisoner of Azkaban, Chamber of Secrets, and Sorcerer's Stone, of course! Duh! It's so obvious to me now, but that did not click. I did not put that together until I realized... That that was the time turner that I was about to put this on, and I and my first thought was, oh, because that's the movie that that's in, and then my brain exploded and went, duh. So that just clicked. You'd think that the one and two, literally inside the Deathly Hollows symbol, would have given it away, plus the fact that there's eight Harry Potter films. Okay, cool. Well, I'm glad I'm not a complete moron, and I figured it out eventually. I bet there's people out there. There's people out there. Who were like, oh yeah, I didn't realize. And I bet you, I bet you there's at least a couple of people out there who are going to never even, never realize that. Never going to dawn on them, okay? So I'm not a complete idiot. But a slight moron. Alright, so well, I'm glad I realized it only took seven days, a full week, for me to go, oh, oh, these are from the movie." Well, how did I want to put this again? Like this? Yeah, let's do it like that. Okay, cool. Well, that's right now. Let's do it like this. Yeah, let's do that. I'm glad I just realized that. So cool. That's good to know. So we're going to have... So we're going through the movies then. One at a time. Duh. Okay, cool. That's awesome. My favorite is Goblet of Fire. So I'm going to be bummed once we get past that one. But there could be some cool stuff left for the last film. When does he stick out? Voldemort sticks out his tongue. Okay, this is what I'm thinking right now. I bought this for that Voldemort minifig because he's got his tongue sticking out. But that makes me specific. I had a t-shirt and everything of this exact moment. When he sticks out his tongue in Goblet of Fire at Harry. Because that's when we because they have to, you know... It's when we first meet him, we got a show. Look at his nasty tongue, too. We, we may have seen it once or twice after that, but that was its most predominant, memorable appearance. Was when he's taunting Harry on the gravestone. I can touch you now. 
literally, those words, that scene, Ralph Fiennes and Voldemort, in that movie, is what made me a Harry Potter fan. Like, I was like, okay, now this is cool. <laughs> um, so I would like to think that Voldemort will be one of the next... Well, not next. I got a nine and... Eight for Prisoner of Azkaban. But then after that, it's got to be in Goblet of Fire, right? Either that or they're going to save him for the end for one of these two. So, we'll see. Anyway, neither here nor there. Good to know what I'm getting into. Okay, so with that deductive reasoning, so now I know that this is from the first movie. This is Harry from the first movie. Okay, cool. And this is from the first movie when they first play which makes perfect sense, which means this, I, I mean, obviously it's something in Diagon Alley. I want to say it's Gringotts. Is this the bank? Is this the door, or is this the wand shop? Maybe it's the wand shop. It's one of the two, right? It's either the it's either Ollivander's wand shop or it's Gringotts bank. At least I know what they're called. I may not know what they look like. Is that the wand shop? Because it had a sign. Yeah. And the bank was more of like a like a pointy, because it's on the corner with the big dragon on it. I know what I'm talking about, I swear. I, I'm a big Harry Potter fan, I swear. Big Harry Potter fan. Uh, so we're going to... It's okay, cool. And then the second movie, obviously, we got the tree. We got the Chamber of Secrets. Duh. And Moaning Myrtle. Cool. First one, third movie. All right. Well, let's get to number eight, then. Now that I know that it's something from The Prisoner of Azkaban. Man, I'll tell you what. Sometimes feeling dumb makes you feel smart when you stop feeling dumb. Or being dumb feels smart. Whatever. Feelings and beings are... What's this? Oh, that's wicked, dude! I love it! That's totally wicked. I was supposed to open this, right? Number eight? Cool. I'm like, spoiler alert! No. It's... Oh, you know I love my minifigs. And one thing I love almost as much as minifigs, a close second, is those micro figs. And I will take any and every micro fig you have. Sure, I've got like half a dozen of these that came with that uh, Hogwarts micro figure scale castle. But I just got some more Dementors! But these can also double as, like, Palpatines, too. Alright, how, how many did they give me? Three? Two? Come on. I think there's supposed to be two in the build. Oh man, I just dropped a piece where I cannot find it. Let's hope it's one of the extra pieces. Nope, it's the other Dementor. Son of a... Let me see this here. Let's see this here. Yeah, there's two. Duh, there's two of them in the build. You have to give me an extra one. That's how it works. Oh, no, they're right here. My bad. You gotta give me an extra one, though. Uh, man. That bums me out. Nope, it's a... Darn it. I dropped a piece I really need. Ah. I think. I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna build this real quick. Watch this. Literally. Okay, we'll see what piece I dropped. Da, 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 da. So we got this green murky piece for the little lake area, and then we got this piece for the water, little shoreline. Get this piece over on yawn. What else? We got this little tree. Oh, nope, I dropped another piece. There will be no one cause. There's two leaves. Oh, I dropped one of the leaves. Flipping. At least I know what color it is. It'll stand out, right? Where'd you go, Leaf? Hello! I mean, it's a matter of time, I suppose, right? Where the heck? There we go. Why did it run away? I found it. Okay. Here we go. How do I build this tree? Oh my gosh. So this thing with this thing goes in front with... That thing on there, who, how now? I'm, I mean, I guess. You would assume. I shouldn't assume, but I would. Boop. 
Gonna make sure it's all straight here. There we go. Okay. And then I've got this other tree that's got what? Let's put this here. Oh, I see. Okay, all right. This is kind of like a very, very minimal build. But I think they're saying if you put this on the first one? Okay, on here. Watch what I'm doing! <laughs> and then put this guy right here. Ooh, I'm flying! This is really cool, actually. This does make a good, like, uh, Halloween advent calendar, I think. It's Harry Potter. If you're gonna get any of the advent calendars and you want to use one of them for Halloween, I would definitely suggest the Harry Potter. I just saw the Guardians of the Galaxy a holiday special trailer that they dropped. And I'm really excited to open that calendar. Because now that I know what it is, me, like many others, I assumed for some odd reason that it was just going to be a variety show. Probably because of the thing that they did in promotion for Guardians 2 with David Hasselhoff. That was like a variety show thing, so I guess I just thought of that when they said the words holiday special. Not realizing that we're just going to get awesome little mini movies like we did with Werewolf by Night. Man, they should have done a Halloween <laughs> calendar for Werewolf by Night. That would have been dope. Give me a man thing. Anyway, is this right? Yeah, I think so. You got the trees. You got the... Yeah, that's cool. I can dig it. That's, that's quaint. You think? Yeah. Well, there you go. There's today's build as seen in the film The Prisoner of Azkaban. So next, we'll have our third... And final from said film. You don't think this set has eight minifigs, do you? There's no way. There's no way it has eight minifigs. How many minifigs did the Star Wars one set come with? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Actually, eight if you include the gonk droid. I suppose it's very possible for this set to come with eight minifigs. One from each movie. Oh, or seven. Yep. You could do seven minifigs, and we'd only get one for the last here. Say Voldemort for last. That's what we all want. Okay. I think that's what's going to happen. I think we're going to get seven minifigs with this set. One for each movie. You know, if you count these as one. Anyway. Okay, cool. Shutting up. Rambled on long enough. Took me long enough to build this build that had only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve pieces. Good times. Love it. I'm very, I'm very happy with this one. I Actually, both of them. I like this little bus a lot, but this, I actually think, is really gnarly. I'll take a micro fig. Any, I just got two micro figs out of the deal. Success!